Mark, another successful game in pre-season. Um, what do you learn from a game like this? Difficult pre-season. Uh, make sure you don't get too carried away or too low with the defeats. Um, it was competitive, which is what I liked. It was a realistic game. Um, pitch was a little bit long, which we knew. We can't do anything about that. So the competitiveness really helped us. And it's honing that real match sharpness for next Saturday. You're a week away. How does it feel? What's, uh, what's your current thought about next week, this time next week? I think it's good that we're anxious. It's good that we're excited. We're good that we're nervous. Um, that makes us more determined to make sure we, we do whatever we can, preparation-wise, for next Saturday. So got a tough week ahead in terms of media um, uh, and making sure we get that spot on because we need to embrace that and we also need to make sure we're, we're spot on with our training and we, we put a team out there that's really prepared. What's your message to the hundreds of people who are switching on to Forest Green Rovers for the first time with all the press that the club's got at the moment? What is it about the football? What is it about the club that's special? Why, why should they come to see a game? Well, I think it's, it's a new story, isn't it? It's a different... It's, it's, it's just what we are that makes us so different and where we are, um, the size of the place and the club. Um, there's, a, there's a mystique about it, and I think that's why people want to come and uh, and sample what it's about. The football's good, we try and play. Uh, it's a great atmosphere at the new lawn and um, we just need to reach out to as many people as we can to, to come and support us. Historic time going into the Football League, you've been there before. What, what should fans, what's different about being in the Football League just for fans and for you as a manager? I think in terms of off the pitch, the, the attendance is bigger, the, the atmosphere is greater, there's more away support, um, you're playing against clubs with big histories. Although we did, we did play with big histories in the National League with Trammer and teams like that, but every game seems to be a, a real intense affair with a big atmosphere. Uh, on the pitch, I think the only difference between the levels is that the higher you go, players make more good decisions than bad. So if we give up two or three chances on goal at our level now, it's they'll take one of them chances. Season ahead, where do you realistically want to be end of the season? Where do you think we're going to be, just for fans? Fans are getting quite excited at the moment about our, our opportunity for next year. Where do you think we could be? I said all along that we want to be competitive, you know, and, and if we can be competitive, who knows where that will take us because, you know, I watched League Two with, with great interest last year and I think on the last game of the season, I think there was 14 teams that could still Getting the promote down to 14th could still you get get you in the playoffs. So if we're in that position, um, come the end or the end of April, early May, then we'll be happy with that.